Okay, cool. So uh, where is Rocha? Okay, there's Rocha. Okay, cool. So uh, Nick, do you kind of want to um, give our new uh, guests, the uh, our new team members, the overview on operationally, like how we do things here at R Square? All right. So every meeting, we start off with like a fun little icebreaker. And like these are questions that like are just kind of like, you know, fun to answer. Uh, don't require too much thought. Like we're not looking for questions like what is the meaning of life <laughs> or anything like that. So uh, I think um, I, I think uh, one question we've had was what was your favorite candle scent? Another was what uh, is your favorite fictional character? You know, so uh, questions like that is is a uh, you know are the are the ones we we normally ask. Okay, cool, awesome. And can you also tell them about like OneDrive and all that? All right, so uh, Rajiv is going to share with you a link to your OneDrive folder. So there's two things you're going to need to do. One is to confirm that you can access the you can access the folder when you click on the link, and two is to post a document in there. It could be just a a blank Word document. It's more just for us to see that you do have access to your folder, uh, because that's where like a majority of your work will be posted, where you'll share work with you know, back with us and, you know, like where files will be shared with you for projects you're working on. Oh, uh, yeah. Thanks for that, Nick. And, um, oh, so just checking something before we kind of like get started. Is everyone that's in the room right now in the Zoom room on the WhatsApp, in the WhatsApp group? Just wanted to double check that. Okay, cool. If anyone is not, please, you know, like use the reaction button or just wave or something, you know, to let us know because it's really important that uh, everyone be in the WhatsApp group since that is primarily, you know, kind of like the main means of communicating between us and to us, you know, like from that standpoint. Okay, so uh, yeah, so I guess before we get started, uh, as I'm looking across the screen, yeah, so uh, Mariam, I'm looking at you. Uh, uh, please introduce yourself. And this is a PSA for Mariam and uh, Navi. Uh, I'm, I'm sure I'm messing your name, but I'm sure you're going to correct me momentarily. Basically, just tell us uh, what your name is, the correct way of saying your name, where you're physically dialing in from, or where you went to school, what was your major, when you graduate, if if you're about to graduate, or if you have graduated, when you graduated, and one fun fact about you. I know that I'm asking you a lot, and if you forget anything, either Nick or Rucha is going to remind you. So Rucha and <laughs> Nick are your safety nets. Hopefully they you know recall everything that I said, but I'm pretty sure that they would. So Mariam, the, uh, the stage is yours. Please, why don't you tell us a little bit about yourself? Okay. Hi, everyone. I'm Miriam. Um, right now, I'm a second year uh, college student studying business, and I'm planning on transferring next year. Um, wait, was that all the facts we have to share? Sorry. And then one fun fact about me is um, I'm allergic to cats, but I love cats, so it really sucks. Okay. And where are you physically dialing from? Oh, I'm from uh, Orange County, California. Okay, cool. Okay, sweet. So, oh, and like, do you, uh, like, uh, what's the correct way of saying your name? Uh, I pronounce it Miriam. Uh, Miriam. Okay, cool. Yeah. Okay. Um, uh, Naviz, um, yeah, why don't you introduce yourself? Okay. Well, my name is Navi. Uh, I'm from Venezuela, but I actually live in Peru. Uh, I went to school to the University of Arizona uh, in communication major, but I'm also studying in one university from Peru, uh, communication and marketing, uh, and intending to graduate this year in December. And one fun fact about me is that I read a lot, even when I don't have the time to, I still read. Oh, and uh, 
And can you say your name again, please? I'm sure I'm going to mess it up and I'm sure I'm going to ask you a few times until I get it right. But what's the correct way of saying it? Yeah, it's Navy. Navy? Okay. Okay. Thank you. Uh, and yeah, and also another thing is could everyone that hasn't please update your name to reflect, uh, you know, what it is that you do. Um, yeah, and a few of us have the name updated. Uh, but those that haven't, uh, please do so. And including the uh, our new team members, please do that as well. Like for example, if you're a writer, then write writer. If you're a designer, write designer. If you're both, write both. Uh, and if you and if it's neither of those, then put a question mark, and we'll figure it out. Uh, okay, okay. So let me let me like update this, update my name. Um, okay. So yeah, so Amariam, I put your OneDrive link in the uh, Zoom chat. Uh, Naivi, um, I think I've created yours. I'm just about to post that link. Just give me a sec. Okay, so both links are posted in the Zoom chat. I will post this in WhatsApp as well, just as a backup. WhatsApp kind of is a backup for everything because it's easily searchable. And um, I also, I posted a video in the WhatsApp, I think yesterday, which is uh, our orientation video. So it's highly recommended that everyone watch that. It's 90 seconds, so it's not long. So uh, it's, it would help if everyone watched that like at least once just to, you know, I know a little bit more about us and how we do things. Okay. And um, okay. So as far as the icebreaker question uh, from the existing crew, who has not asked the icebreaker so far? Uh, I haven't. Me. Okay. Uh, okay, uh, Jenny. Wait, I thought Jenny, you wait. Didn't you ask the icebreaker last night? No? no, I didn't. Okay, cool. So Jenny, why don't you uh, give us an icebreaker? Um, I'll do. What is everyone's favorite candy bar? Okay, that's cool. So mine is, I would say, Kit Kat. Um, and I'll popcorn it over to Janice. Oh, and one more thing, Jenny, I'm, I'm sorry to interrupt you. Uh, another thing is like, if you could also in your name, like include your location, uh, that also is something that would help because again, it just kind of like helps my understanding of, you know, where people are to kind of like better understand the time zones that we're kind of like dealing with. Yeah, so if you can like do that too, that'd be cool. Um, and also, I think it'll look really cool in the screenshot when we take it, you know, to kind of see the different locations that we have. I think that'll look really uh, interesting as well. Uh, okay, yeah, I'm, I'm sorry, Jenny, I'm sorry to interrupt. Yeah, please uh, go ahead. Um, I would say my favorite is probably Kit Kat too. And I'll pass it to Jolie. Um, I would say my favorite is Snickers. Um, I really like Snickers. I think they're really good. And I'll pass it to Arma. Um, uh, I'd probably have to go Kit Kat as well. Like, I just really enjoy the fact that you can just like break them into little pieces and not like feel bad about that. So. I'd probably, yeah, I'd probably go for Kit Kat. And uh, I'll, I'll pass it over to Nivy. Okay, I think that my favorite is anything to do with chocolate, but I think sneakers and Hershey's are the ones that I like the most. And I'll pass it to 
Anastasia. Oh, so just one question. So I know like a couple of couple of you said Snickers. So is it the Snickers with peanuts or is it the Snickers with almonds? Unless there's another version of Snickers that's out that I'm not aware of. Yeah, if you could kind of like uh, clarify that in the chat, I think that would be interesting for everyone to see. Oh yeah, Anastasia, over to you. Um, my favorite is definitely Reese's because I, I just love peanut butter so much. Um, I'll pass it to, to Nick. Um, let's see. Well, I actually, I'm probably going to say Hershey's because it's probably the only one I can actually eat. I think it's probably the only one I can actually eat because uh, I can't eat Kit Kats or Snickers or Reese's because I actually have a peanut allergy. Uh, like s to the point where if I consume it, it's off to the hospital for me. Oh, wow. Jeez. Sounds serious. So, uh, so yeah, I'm, I'm going to go with Hershey's because it's because it's the only one that's not going to. It, uh, it's, it's the only one that's not going to require an EpiPen and a trip to the <laughs> and a trip to the hospital. Nice. Now hospitals are boring. Yeah. Uh, are you going right. to popcorn it too? I'll pass it over to Mar to Mariam. Okay, my favorite candy controversial opinion is almond joy. Like some of my friends think I'm psycho for that, but I don't know. I used to hate them, but I really love them now. So, and I'll pass it to Abigail. So what was which, Almond Joy again? So which version of Almond Joy? Is it the regular or the one with dark chocolate? Which one? The dark chocolate one. Okay, nice. It's, it's like the one the, that has coconut. Yeah, and like an almond in the middle. Uh, yeah. All right, I'm probably going to make myself sound really old here, but what's Almond Joy again? It's like the candy bar with like coconut and then almonds in it and then covered in dark ch chocolate or dark chocolate. Like milk chocolate or dark chocolate. Yeah. Oh, who did you popcorn it over to, Marianne? Uh, Abigail. Okay. Um, I think my favorite candy bar, I just like Hershey's. I just like classic Hershey's. I'm not allergic to anything like Nick, but I just like classic Hershey's. <laughs> Um, and I'm going to popcorn it to Esteban. Um, I'll say I like, um, what's it called? Mars, Mars bars. Um, and I'll pass it on to Luis. I don't know if he's going. Yeah. Um, I'm going to have a I say uh, Hershey's just, you know, the classic one. Just, you know, for chocolate. And uh, I'll part to, to you, Rajiv. Oh, thank, thank you, Larry. <laughs> so as far as candy bars go, I would say Kit Kat, but not the Kit Kat that's available in the US, the Kit Kat that's available in England, uh, that's originally made by Roundtree before I think Nestle bought them or whatever. But but I think the the UK version of uh, Kit Kat is like way better than the American. The American one is just, I don't know, for those that like the American, okay, I'm just gonna like stop there, but the UK one just totally rocks. And I absolutely freaking love, love, love Mars. Unfortunately, they're not available in the US. You can only get them in like Canada or other places. Yes, you can get them in England as well. Uh, Absolutely, I'm crazy for Mars, and also I'm super crazy for Almond Joy. I just like love Almond Joy. Oh my god, it's just so like yummy, and they're just like so like freaking tiny. Unfortunately, so you gotta have you gotta buy like multiple pieces of them because just one in isn't cutting it for me. So so yeah, uh, and did anyone not go? Oh wait, oh yeah, Rucha, of course. How can I forget Rucha? Just so, Rucha, I'm gonna pop corner over to you. Okay. Um, I also really like Kit Kats. Um, but I like like the matcha ones that you can get at 99 Ranch Market. Wait, matcha, is that the one with the, the green tea thing? Yeah. You you like that? Yeah. Oh my god. Okay, wow. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. 
Okay. Uh, is there, so is that like the only version of KitKat that you like, the matcha one? No, I like the regular ones too, but I like the matcha more. Oh, okay. So does this mean that you like the, like the matcha drink as well? Yeah, I do. My best friend says it tastes like peas, but like, I don't see it. <laughs> well, I like peas, but I don't like matcha. But, you know. <laughs> Interesting. Cool. Awesome. So Jenny, thanks a ton for that very interesting and clever yeah. question. And, you know, but, again, for but, everyone but, that's that's watching, this is kind of an example, like what Nick alluded to earlier of like a simple, easy question. That's not to say that, uh, you know, not simple questions aren't appreciated. Like, in fact, Armand asked like an amazing question earlier, which I don't think per se comes into the box of a simple question, uh, which was... <laughs> Because in fact, Armand, why don't you tell them what their question was? Why am I the one only talking here? Yeah. Yeah. Yesterday, um, I asked the I asked the question of who in the who in the Zoom would you hug, which I guess doesn't count as a as a simple question, but but, but yeah. Well, that was a great question. You know, it kind of made you stop and kind of like think for a moment. Not that you didn't have to stop and think for this question, you did, but it was just like a different. I guess it different you kind of like a different side of your brain was activated or whatever. So yeah, thanks for that, Arman. And, you know, that kind of a question is fine as well. Uh, obviously, you know, any question that you ask, I really should not make someone too uncomfortable. <laughs> I mean, no, like, I guess that question did maybe make some people slightly uncomfortable, but hopefully not too much. Uh, and yeah, that was, I guess, an experiment as well. So thank you for that, Arman. Mm -hmm. Wait, oh, no, no, wait, 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 uh, wait, uh, wait, 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 did Jolie ever go? Yeah, she did. Oh, okay. Yeah, I think Jolie said uh, Snickers, right? If I heard you correctly, Jolie? Yeah, I said Snickers. Okay. okay. Cool. All right. Yeah, also, Jolie, right now, I'm not able to see your face. I can just see a good view of your forehead, but not your face. Hello. Okay. Uh, yeah, so, okay, so this is the time where we take a quick screenshot and post in the WhatsApp chat to commemorate this joyous occasion and let everyone know that we hung out and had a good time. So on the count of three, please put your pearly whites on display and give us your best smile. Because who knows, somebody may see this and be like, I want that person as my brand ambassador. Okay, anywho, so with, with, uh, with, without any further ado, one, two, three. Okay, so hopefully everyone had their eyes open. I will confirm that momentarily. Just give me a sec. Oh yeah, that was a great picture. Awesome. Awesome, awesome. Okay, cool. So yeah, let me pause the recording.